Hi guys! Um, I don't know kung saan ako napag-start. Kaboko, dugay na dyan na o ako naka-video, no? And, um, I should not be, like, filming a video, but it seems like I need somebody to talk. Kana bitawang feeling ni mo nga. I just also want to, like, take this opportunity nga i-video na ako ang self and to talk something para as a reminder as well sa akong kagalingon na I've been in this kind of situation and um, if one day I will overcome this I know nga um, you know gagyan hao ni nga face for me to um, become more stronger I guess and um, you know keep fighting and you know surviving in life and um, I know guys it's been a while na I haven't like I haven't been open um, in my life because to be honest I've been through I've been through I've been into like um, I don't know I, I don't know if uh, it's like a rough situation or whatever or maybe it's just me like telling myself na stressful siya. but to be honest yeah it is really stressful um, I haven't been talking about like my status here in Canada and um I know nga um daghan sad na mga pareha na ko na still um like unsa still like striving um uh, para lang makuha og status here and um I don't know it's kind of like talking about like getting that status or kana pong you know if you've been like into depression or like frustration like kinda marina na mga dahong gaka feel karon nga marako gaka frustrate and ka depressed because of that certain like you know status nga kailangan na ho siya ma achieve so uh moto siya guys so as what i've said no nga um karon like i feel so down Okay, morag like I've like you know like na 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 hong eagerness nga gusto na ko nga maabot ang nga face nga you know maachieve na nimo and even though daghan ka um plano sa imong life like you want to like nakai timeline but you know at the end of the day morag dili jud siya um mooy Morag, di yun siya mo yung masunod because, ah, uh, di yun siya, like, imong plan mo yung masunod because there are greater plan than our plan. So, um, sorry guys, kung, kung ahong mood and ang ahong, like, I don't know, sorry, or ang ahong tingog is, like, so low or wala dyan energy, okay, this is what I feel right now and I, I, I just wanna, like, uh, share this or probably kanang gusto lang na jud na siya nga i-video para one day tan-aw na ako galing yung oh my god I've been that situation and again so um I don't know kung i-open mo na topic about kanang status kung sa jud kay Mara but siya taas mo siya kung suryahan ni mo so basically um nisunod ko diri sa Canada as caregiver so mag-turn ako 4 years karong November and um um supposedly unta kung nagtuloy tuloy lang akong papel atong first employer na ho two, after 2 years pwede na ako maka-apply og ginatawag na tong PR or permanent residency but unfortunately namatay siya so naputol akong papel and it, it took me like probably 1 year and 4 months para makita og another amo para mo continue sa sponsorship um so karon ang government di open up like um another like kanang program ng ginatawag ng interim nga interim means like even though nara kay one year experience pwede na ka apply o PR so diha diha kong um na fall in diha ko ni try og apply cause it's like um ab ganang you know you, you I wanted nga mapadali ang life and um kay Gusto na ko nga, um, you know, ma-change na bitaw ang face sa mong life. I know, like, I sound like gadali ko. But to be honest, like, it's already my fourth year. And I should, like, completed my PR na before mahuma ng fourth year. Okay? It should be like that, manggol. And, um, 
mo nagkakaprostrate ko because it seems like um it's so perfect timing na I I'm not really like kanang kumbaga gestorya nga mo jud ni siyang reason but it seems like ato bitong issue about Philippines and like Canada about garbage thing like that didto siya nag so good nga kanang medyo nilaylo ang pag process like cuz um before ana pas pas ang processing and after ato mihinay siya and then now more gi siya na apektuhan tungod ato siya nga problema and yeah that's that's really my um situation right now i'm still like um waiting sa kanang ahong papel para mahimo kong permanent residency although mo fourth year na ako karong November that's also like one thing nga uh, ka stress na jud ko kasi it's been ha- how many months na lang sa August na karong September October November it's like almost three months na lang in you know what i mean like <sighs> and um kana mi tong dili lang siya status like you know this is like kanang mura siya ticket for you to move forward on your life diri sa Canada para kung gusto ka mo skwela you can go to school or kung gusto ka probably nga um, you know magbinyo ka para makuha makuha ni mo imong bana kung nasa sa Pilipinas or else ka nang kung nasa diri um, you know you can start a new life cuz like i'm not like getting any younger like you know i'm already in my 30s and i felt like i'm still in this kind of situation and my situation right now it's like uh, i've been dealing for almost 4 years and it's hard and it's very hard dude guys like sa una like i was like telling myself okay bahalag unsa work maka abroad lang and stuff like that and like i know nga uh, i should have not like kanang abroad it's an easy life but that was my thinking before and then now when I'm out, I realized that it's not that easy like you know like it's very very hard and kanang emotionally physically mentally jud guys ma test jud ka kung unsa jud ka ka ligon and most of the time jud I'm kanang I felt like I'm so I'm so alone. Dili sa dili I don't know how to dili man say you're alone pero kada bitong you kada bitong nasanay ka sa Pilipinas na you can just do everything what you want and then kanang maraga ka kuha jud dimo siya in a snap and kaya ni mo siya abton but here you are been restricted because of that status. Kada iya na bitaw you are been restricted kun sa imong dapat buhaton because you need to get that first before or mean after makabuhat ka anything else and and yun bitaw lisod jud siya guys and i know nga and i'm not you know kanang dragging pod i know daghan og daghan pa jud ang mas galisod sa sitwasyon karon like in you know in other corners of the world i know mas daghan pa jud worse worse and worse nga situation but kanang yun bitaw like Siguro ang kwan mong god ang mga uh, ni it's like kanang bitong imong patient is kanang mura bitog sky's the limit pero karon bit na mura gamay na lang jud bitaw nga nabilin for you to like you know still pursuing about life okay kumbaga kung feel, feeling jud ako mura na upos na jugo mura i feel like gamay na lang jud ana bitaw but I don't know. Maybe it's just today. Maybe it's just tomorrow. Maybe it's just for a week, a month. I don't know. I'm not sure. But I'm just always gonna remind myself that delete me forever. Na feeling. Na I know. Like uh, eventually, um, the rainbow will come, and you know, will turn everything. Sunshine will come. I'm sorry, guys. I'm so emotional now. Oh my god. Like, I don't wanna be emotional because, I don't know, pero sometimes, you know, you need to vent it out, take it out, para ma-release ni mo, kay kung dili. Like, it's just so heavy lang just sa mong heart nga, you know, you feel that way. That's why I decided to take this video, because I wanna talk to myself, probably, na, you know, it's it's okay. 
and everything will be okay in the future. Nakaya ni mo ni, you can do it. Um, it's just a struggle or challenges of life, and I know there's more than that. After, and you can do it. You can do it. Just run now, guys. You need my whole self, nga. I nga. I still have a chance, nga. Uh, one day everything will be okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm not taking this video para maluoy mo na ho. It's it's not more. It's it's more like a therapy para sa own self. Is this like, you know, making video makes me happy, and also makes me reminded na you know life is not about happy lang ka per me. You have also like time na you are in the lowest point of your life, and you need to be reminded niya yeah, na yeah, yung life. And um. Siguro po, guys, I just wanna take you in this journey. Yeah, para one day kung makuha man ako siya in God's time, I also gonna share that moment with you guys. Yeah, finally, at last, I made it. Yeah, after all the struggles, after all the mga frustrations, yung na feel na ho, I made it. I just wanna thank you guys for just listening to me. It means a lot. Yeah. Um, you take your time, your mommy now so home banga yao ya. Um yeah guys, I guess um more siguro to ha Siguro, I'm gonna make a reaction video one day kung okay na ako, one day kung na okay na tanan ng, you know, dagan sa home life. I'm gonna make a reaction video. Ano yung libot? Karang kumun sa ako kastuplin. Siyo, marag buang, gayaw-yaw nga sing hilak about, you know, about any nga situation. But again, guys, thank you. I just wanna thank you for being so patient with me and for listening it means a lot you know when somebody's going to like hardship or hard times if just one person or nga willing mommy now it means a lot and um again guys um hopefully i can talk to you soon um hopefully as well i can make more videos after and for sure guys um i gonna take you Um, in God's perfect time, kung makuha na nato na siya nga, um, reward after all the hardships. So again guys, thank you so much for watching this video and, um, I just want to remind you that, um, life is still beautiful. Um, I just want to remind you and I just want to remind myself that life is still beautiful. You just need to go with the flow and we can overcome this and everything will be okay in god's time again guys thank you so much for watching i'm gonna see you soon bye